1 million power in 10 days. Uh, I had to backtrack on my plan a little bit that I was going to slow down and perhaps try and start hoarding. But because I needed to finish the academy and because I was building the barracks, I couldn't really stop. You have to push through those buildings. You should never wait the timer on either of those. Plus, I needed more power to find a spot, to, to find an alliance that had a training altar, which is what I need for the next part of my plan. So, back to the drawing board on hoarding. I think, realistically, you've got to get at least City Hall level 17 cooking before you can start to slow down your power. So, I called it a bit early. Unless, of course, you've got yourself into a good alliance, but uh, I hadn't. Uh, I had to be a bit more sellable with a bit more power. Let's have a look though. I have had some good progress though on my expedition. I have three star 25, I have three star 30, three star the second bonus level, and three star all the way up to 34. But Elsid here at 35 is too much of an ask. I just need more troops um, to overwhelm him. So that is going well. I've had a bit more luck on Commanders. Uh, I still don't have Imop, but I've moved this guy's to skill to four. Sun Skoo's skill is on four. Uh, Baybar's is only on two, but let's keep the fingers crossed. And I've got City Keeper to level 40, so he has got that bonus five talents, which is helping him. Let's have a little look at the breakdown of the 1 million. So, building, of course, nearly 400. Technology has moved on a little bit. Troop power uh, is crawling forward, as is commander power. But there's the 1 million. The troops that I've got all these three stars with, so 166,000, so about 16k more than last time. But I'm waiting for the training altar before... I push that a lot more. I've had a bit of luck with achievements. I've moved the five key reward done. And then the Vanquisher three key. I did have to get my farms to uh, attack me with various commanders to get this over the uh, to get this over the line. But they're a nice easy one where it is Boudicca, five points and such like. So that's the achievements. Let's hit the help. So I'm in a nice little one alliance at the moment with three altars. Well, two altars attached and one altar about to be attached. Um, I may try and get into a better alliance again, but I'm pretty happy here at the moment. I have been trying to have a chat with the top alliances, but um, of course, really, I try and stay out of them. But if they're happy to have me, then I will go along. So let's have a look. Uh, obviously starting to get quite a few more gifts in this alliance. Hit the helps. Let's have a look in the bag. Resources took a bit of a smash in. Uh, I've also been needing gold to progress my Sunset team's uh, equipment. So that's not brilliant. But I have still to date not taken a single I, uh, bit of resources out of my farms. Everything I've done so far has been gathered or out of the bag. Uh, training speed ups are the only one doing remotely well. Oh no, well, researchers haven't been touched. Um, I occasionally use the researchers just to finish one before midnight, but I did hammer into my um, universals, including buying three eight hour speed ups just to get the academy finished so I wouldn't be losing out on that time. Uh, equipment's starting to shape up. Uh, nothing special yet. Haven't had a single expertise crit, so that's unlucky. We've got some supply boxes, like those silver keys. Help me with my city keeper. Five on the legendary. Saving up for the next step on Joan. Uh, still thinking I've perhaps made a mistake on Joan. But let's push her through to expertise and see what happens. So, just a quick update today. Um, not a lot else to report, just clearing my AP and getting on with my real world activities, um, just keeping my farm ticking over, they've got another 10 days to get to 16 and all of them are doing well on the Alliance coin, like this one is, so I'm 77k ahead on the Alliance coin, so I can relax a little.
a little bit, but of course I'm not getting the slow build flags as I don't have control over the flags in this alliance. We've done commanders, we've had a look at the alliance. I think that's everything on the video. Sunsets, of course, a car crash. I will try and get into the top um, the top 100 to get one gold key for the weekly reward tonight. But I'll be doing that just before midnight to hopefully sneak in and get, the silver, uh, get a gold key instead of a silver key as a weekly reward. So I think now this might be the last daily update I make now for a while. Uh, perhaps until Wednesday because I've just got too much on in the real world. Um, but let me know if you're still enjoying these. Uh, what I would say is, although the viewing numbers aren't very high, people seem to be watching the whole video, which is always nice when I've watched when I've been making them daily. But I'll have a think about how I will continue on, or if I'll start to make slightly different content, perhaps con concentrating on the Sunset Canyon team with this account just in the background, because of course. In terms of content-wise, I'm not really pushing power fast. I'm not doing anything special. Uh, I don't know if people really want to follow uh, an account that's just gaining at a casual speed. Um, but I will try and make the sunset content interesting. Although I have created myself a huge problem that uh, some of the people in my sleeper group are, are very... Oh, there's a nice whale are very well equipped and using uh, strategies that I recognise. <laughs> so, big shout out to them. But let's see if they can take on the Logic Bank when I am ready.